Tonight, we're learning more about a catalytic converter theft that erupted in gunfire. A Concord homeowner was nearly killed during a confrontation. And as KPIX 5's Katie Nielsen explains, police say property crimes are becoming more violent. Well, I had looked out the window and that's when I seen like the bright light, which is in the picture. A neighbor's surveillance camera caught the commotion on video. The victim was too afraid to talk with us on camera, but he said he heard something outside around 315 this morning and saw the suspect stealing the catalytic converter off his Prius. <laughs> He says he jumped in the damaged car and chased after the suspects. But when they got onto Solano Way in Concord, he says the suspects started shooting at him. He was not hurt, but the Prius was hit twice. That's something that we've seen trending more lately, people being fired at for those property-related crimes. Police say if you do see someone trying to steal something from your car, the best thing you can do is be a good witness and have clear video on a home surveillance camera. Record the type of car, see if you can memorize the license plate. They should not chase after the suspect. The Sheriff's Department notes that communities across the Bay Area have seen an increase in these kinds of opportunistic property crimes, like car break-ins and catalytic converter thefts over the past six months. And and while chasing the thieves might seem like a good idea, it's best to simply call 911. It is not worth your life. It's not worth the property. We can replace that. In Alameda County, Katie Nielsen, KPIX 5. Concord police say the suspect's car was spotted. The driver led officers on a chase all the way to the Caldecott Tunnel, and then they managed to get away.